Yeah. They're actually really similar. They're, they're well. identical. That's like awesome. Like exactly Wait, can we compare? Our flight is early tomorrow morning and we have not even started packing yet. And it is now... It's 2pm and we have not even started. I've gotten my lashes done, as you can see. These seriously need doing, like, are you kidding? Let's go do our lashes, because this is not okay. <laughs> I'm there for like eight, nine days and I've not packed a single item of clothing and we're going on like dinners. There's like a 90s themed party as well. Do I know what I'm wearing for that? Absolutely no clue. This is the mission today. Get packed, get organized. I'm gonna show you my suitcases right now and it's a mess. So please no judging me. Okay, thanks, love you. Right, let's pack. But I'm just waiting on you to go back the curtains And I've been standing on the sideline Waiting till the time's right to make you mine Cause ever since the first time I opened up just an update i actually made it to my hotel room Woo! i have extreme hot hair um <laughs> i think it's about 4 or 5 a.m in the uk right now <sighs> i'm so tired i'm literally just waiting for a doordash order because knowing me i forgot to bring my cellar water so I, I do have like a bit of concealer on and i have no way to take it off i swear american bathrooms are the best bathrooms ever because look at this like huge mirrors i think my eyes are like bloodshot at this point so i'll see you soon hello um okay so we have officially checked into our second hotel room so all of the athletes are actually staying in the same hotel i think it's so we can all get like cars together and everything to like the shoots and whatnot so a little tour of the hotel room incoming honestly quite similar like it's not changed a whole lot. I've actually got a queen, another queen size bed. And then I have this cool view of Sugarland. The plan is at the moment is, I need to set you guys down somewhere because this is tedious to hold up, to be honest with you. A very big, big week ahead, which I am so excited for. There's so many things planned. I actually cannot wait. It's crazy because I feel so energetic, but actually in the UK, I think it's like 8 p.m. The plan for today is get ourselves sorted. I also need to fake tan because um, I'm very pale. Also, I forgot a few things that I need to go buy. I completely forgot a toothbrush. How does someone travel 17 hours to the other side of the world and forget a toothbrush? I remembered everything else except a toothbrush. Actually, no, I forgot a couple of other things as well, but a toothbrush. In America, they do loads of like minis of everything. So in the UK, it's hard to find minis. You can go to Boots and get like go in the travel section, but it's you're very limited on what you can get in the small version. Whereas here, I just I can't explain it. They have minis of everything, everything. To be fair, I did actually leave some room in my suitcase just so I can bring back a few bits and bobs because there are a few things that I just I got here last time and that now I can't live without and I can only get them when I'm here so I'm stocking up. <laughs> I'm so excited to be here, I'm, I'm, honestly, I'm just so grateful that I get to do this, like, I want to cry every time. <laughs> every time I get off the plane to anywhere, I just, I feel like bawling my eyes out because I'm like, this is way too good to be true, like, what is, what, look, how? <laughs> how? Like, I am just literally some random girl, like, it blows my mind, like, it just, it doesn't feel real and it doesn't, sometimes I don't feel like I deserve to be here. Um, but I do work very hard, so I know that I do, but it's like, it's just this conundrum of like, what is going on? <laughs> Why am I in the United States right now with like my favorite brand in the entire planet? <laughs> how, how does this happen? And I think there's like 40 altogether, 40 like athletes, influencers, people that they work with, um, like exclusively. And that I 
think 99% of them are all here on this trip. So it'll be really, really cool to meet everyone. Without further ado, we need to go buy a toothbrush because I just, I just feel disgusting. I know they look white, but they just feel. How pretty is that sunset? Um, just wanted to show you guys around like the pool area. How cool is this? The behavior, dress, the way you express yourself, it was very stern and rigid. The reason we tolerate so much shit is because we have strong respect for people's personal space. Okay. <laughs> and then like some of them... Well, that was fucking scary. Where are the miracles? <laughs> yeah. Got the sun up on my face. I think I need a little break. Hello. Hello, love. Hello, ma'am. <laughs> no, I've also heard as well. Like, you're good, you're good. I'm like, I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> so I need a little more just to fill up the slate. Big ass bag, can fill up some space? Yeah. What we do next, just can fill it in the place. Look, lately my life been a whirlwind. Okay, so you're gonna be on the. Am I this way? Yes, opposite. Switch. Okay. I'm like this. Oh, I do that pose all the time. That's so easy for me to do. <laughs> yeah, you know how to just get yeah. there. You're you're gonna be leaning to the left, kind of like. <laughs> Why did I pick the clapping pose? Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> I did my toe. <laughs> <laughs> one, one more. So funny. One, three, two, one. <laughs> I think we got it. I I'm think like dead on. I don't know about you. Damn, that's fucking dope. That's sick. Oh, there we go. And they're, they're actually really similar. They're, they're well. That's like awesome. Right? That's like exactly Wait, can we compare them? Oh, that's crazy. That is crazy. Those are a little more centered, but you're not centered. That's my picture. Tell us about the picture. Yeah. It's five years old. I think it was the first time we ever met and I just signed to Alphalete and him and Nabil came over to Liverpool. Uh -huh. um, and I think I did my athlete video. Yeah, we How just went to walk around. We were like, okay, so like, where do we shoot? Yeah. So we were like, I was like, let's go walk around. So we just went to walk around, found this badass bridge. Mm -hmm. And that was probably the one of the best athlete trips we've ever had. Yeah, that was so, so much fun. fun. Yeah. Honestly, just nuts to see like how much the, the company has progressed over the course of five years. It's just absolutely insane to but see. But it still feels like kind of similar? Oh my God, yeah. It still feels like such a tight-knit family, but it's just the scale of it is just, obviously, this didn't exist five years ago. So it's just mad, really mad, but really cool to like see it grow. So Fuck thank it. you for having me. Thank you <laughs> for being here. We went to dinner as a team. It was so much fun having everyone together. The best steak ever, by the way. And then the following day in the morning, we went to an arcade, we played laser tag. This was so much fun. I was so sweaty after it by just sprinting around in this dark room, lasering people. Um, and then later on, we went back to the hotel, got ready and got onto a party bus. Like, are you kidding? Here's Gabby giving us a show. <laughs> um, this was so much fun. Honestly, love the fact that they hired this bus to take us to Alpha Land VIP bit where we had a 90s themed party like this was one of the best nights ever decoration as well that they had um for the 90s party was so cool it was so nice to see everyone dress up proper old school um definitely definitely a fun night and the alpha league crew know how to party if they know one thing it's partying. <laughs> and then the following day, I got to meet with the designers at Alpha Lee and go through the entire year of designs. Like, I'm not even joking. They had on the wall that I can't actually show you the entire year laid out for us. And it was the best thing. <laughs> it was one of my favorite days because it's so cool actually talking to the designers and sort of giving our input and giving our opinions. Okay, so it's actually our last night my last night i'm being quiet because i'm in the corridor um i'm just on the way to dinner with kieran marion amy and christine um we're gonna grab some food well they're gonna grab some food i've already just had lunch um like a really late lunch and oh, 
and yeah and then that's it that's the trip basically over i really hope i filmed enough i don't know if i have because it's honestly been like a million miles an hour so i don't know if i've managed to film enough content but i hope you guys are enjoying the vlog so far um i'm going to try and film as much as i can of like the last little tiny dinner i'm going to try and insert as many clips as i can but yeah let's go we're having we're having a blast <laughs> Hello, hello, hello. 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 Hi. <laughs> I think so. Oh my god. We're at a really good place. In the middle of Sugarland. Sugar Land. Sugar Land of Sugar. Sugar Land. Sugar Land. 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 Sugar Land. Sugar Land. Sugar Land. Sugar Land. Oh. Looks like a shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's literally shaved like a. Oh. There you go. Got a nice little shit there. <laughs> so big, like <laughs> you were like, is there a smaller size? That looks good. Yeah, they weigh them. You can, but you can. This was the moment I realized I really screwed up my froyo because I had assumed that, like, that's why I mentioned, oh my god, this pot is so big because I thought it was just one price per pot. So obviously, I'm gonna fill it to the top. I didn't realize that it's actually by weight. So everyone else put like the tiniest smidgen of froyo in their massive pot, and I filled mine to the brim. Good. Mm. Look at her. Look at her. <laughs> the lady was looking like at me like, is she okay? Who eats this big of an ice cream? It's bigger than my head. So we are going to dinner. I got us tickets to Bowling for Soup and Reese is getting us dinner. So that should be a really nice night. But yeah, I just thought I'd pop on and say hi because it's actually been a few days since you last saw me on this vlog. I have basically died for three days. <laughs> like I died and came back to life clearly um, because all I've done is sleep all day and get to bed at like 5 a.m. because of my severe jet lag. So I'm exhausted. I've not been able to sleep at all. I've got so much work to do as well, but I thought I'd give it a little rest so we can go and have like a nice little evening. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to pop in, say hi, show you my outfit, see if you guys like it. And yeah, I will see you in a bit. Just thought I'd clock in. Bye. We're soup and we are from the great state of Texas. I'm whispering because Reese is asleep, but does anyone else not sleep through the night when they have a drink? Like. So my body is just like, yeah, 5 a.m. Time to wake up. I'm gonna lose all my gains. I'm gonna age faster. It's just like an array of issues. I am not gonna be drinking again for a while, like at least a good few months because this is, as you get older, drinking just like, oh my God, it just affects you so much more. Like my sleep, like, and my hangovers, like everything is 10 billion times worse. Especially now that I track everything on like an Apple Watch or whatever you track stuff on. Once you start doing that, it's crazy. My recovery goes from like 80 to 50% if I'm around the times I'm training to literally like 5%. <laughs> Breathing, respiratory, like everything's red. <laughs> so alcohol is bad. Um, last like, week or two, I have been probably too much for my system at the moment and I really need to, like just time to recover ever since the first really really quickly gonna run you through all the things that I brought back from America that I absolutely love so starting off we've got chocolate chip cookie dough date bars I absolutely love these for like a pre-workout snack this one I need like some energy and like just some carbs the ingredients are literally dates cashews chocolate chip sugar, coca liquor, organic coca butter, sea salt. Like, very simple. It, it is like semi-processed, but it's not like ultra, ultra processed, bad for you type of vibe. They're like a nice little treat because obviously there is sugar in here, but it's not that bad. Got some from this brand as well because I wanted to try the variation. Um, also got these little raspberry ones, raspberry truffle bars. 
um, more, more date bars, literally like boxes and boxes of date bars. I bought some melatonin because we obviously can't get this here in the UK. Also got some LA dates because these are really nice and then some makeup removers. I love the minis, like how cute is that? And I tend to travel quite a bit. So these are really perfect to just throw my bag for like a weekend away or something. Moving on to the biggest section of a haul here. I did not know that these were even like a thing. Like I had no idea about this. Freeze dried strawberry slices. Who the hell invented these? I don't know. Why do we not have them in the UK? I have absolutely no idea because these are delicious. They're like strawberry chips. And I was like, There's, there must be a million artificial things in here. And I look in the ingredients and it's literally just freeze dried strawberries. That is it. And I was blown away. They're like crispy. They're literally chips, like strawberry chips. Um, and then I also got the freeze-dried raspberries as well. I absolutely love this. Even to like crumble it up to put it on like, like oats or something or crumble it and put it in like a yogurt. I bought like the big pack, but then I also bought all of the like mini packs as well. Cause I feel like they're so good for like just throwing in your bag and stuff. Not so healthy situation going on in this corner. Um, I just got Kinder Bueno minis because I don't think we have these in the UK and I am a sucker for Kinder Bueno. Very highly processed, very bad for you, loads of seed oils, not a great choice of food, but I absolutely love them and balance is key, so. I am absolutely exhausted from the week and everything you can probably tell, so I'm gonna go relax, probably edit this video and just have a really chill night, um, but thank you for following me along this big, big, big vlog. Thank you so much if you've made it this far into the video. And I will see you guys next week. There's a massive Alphalete haul coming for their birthday sale. I'm going to go through all the items, huge haul, try on, all of that. See you next week.